months since I have actually released a vlog and uh, I'm going to attempt to do that again today. skiing just got up this morning I got up at about 7 and made breakfast and uh, now we are currently getting ready I'm gonna figure out how to take all of my skis and poles over here and carry them while vlogging at the same time which I'm guessing is going to be a pretty big challenge but before we do that let's just look at the view we have outside it's awesome it's gonna be an awesome day of skiing I'm still adjusting to this altitude because I'm used to living in Dallas, Texas, where altitude is not too high. How are we doing over here? Great. Getting ready for day two of skiing? Yeah, just got to fill up my camelback. Yeah. We're all set to go. That was the first one of the day. How'd you do? Not did you break good. a ski? Maybe. We don't know. You may have broken a ski, maybe? <laughs> I don't know. Only I would do that. It's okay. It's only your first ski trip. You'll get there. Break a lot more. But look at this view. Look at where we are. This is insane. so freaking cold and the snow is deep and I'm hiking over to get some photos and videos of this insane view. Look at that. It is so cold. My hands, I don't know if you can see, are just up here to explore. We took this lift over here. My throat is very dry. It's like 10 degrees. And I'm used to Texas where it doesn't get this freaking cold. It is. That's all about I have to say. But the view over here is just breathtaking. Like these mountains over here. The air is very thin. I'm not used to this. And we're about to ski all the way down this. I may or may not shoot video of it. Thomas, how are you doing? Pretty good, man. Just glad to be here. Yeah. It is huh? very cold. Not too bad. Want to figure out yeah. how to get all the way over there.
has the start the first run of day three been? It has been very tough. Tell them what. Tell, tell the camera what you guys. Have well, been doing. We went up American Eagle and took Accelerator. Then we went down a blue to Super B. Took Super B all the way up, and then went down a black. That was really kind of a double black at the top. Uh, down to uh, the resolution width. So very far side of the mountain, and I fell down about 50 yards of a. Up the side of a, of a hill. Okay. So, that was yeah. so for those who don't have not been to Copper Mountain or unfamiliar with it, oh, it's hit sawtooth unless you're pretty good. He just did a really hard run that I would not be able to do, and so I'm definitely not going to head that way. But yeah, just finished the third, I mean, first run of the third day. It is snowing like crazy out here. I don't know if you can see it. It is beautiful. It's a beautiful day. It's very cold colder than yesterday, but it feels good because I won't be, probably won't be covered in sweat by the end of this, but probably will, I don't know. Depends on how many runs I do. Yeah, it's going to be a good day. We just got off the rendezvous lift. My hands are, it's very cold up here. My hands are starting to freeze off, so I'm just going to cut the video off, but uh, yeah, let's get some powder.